Hey there everyone, Dr. Beth Westy here, and uh, I am live with Azalea. And Josefina. And Josefina, uh, her dolly Josefina is with us as well. <laughs> we are going to be talking about stress and how it can hinder you from getting to your goals, getting to your weight loss goals, that type of a thing. So I do have a whole section in my book, The Female Fat Solution, um, which is just on Amazon that talks about tips, tricks, and how to manage your stress with your nutrition, matching your foods to your hormones, to your cycle, all that other stuff, all in here. And then this is what I take women through in my 12-week program. So gals that sign up for my 12-week program where we look at matching your nutrition, it is customized, meal plans, grocery list, everything, tailored and tweaked, personalized to you to help you get towards your goals. So when we talk about stress, one of the really important things to look at is that stress can really be one of those things that keeps you from getting to your goals. Um, it causes women to gain weight, meaning it flips this switch um, to turn on this component that actually causes your body to store fat. It just, it just does. That's the reaction in women. So it can be really, really frustrating. <laughs> that's the face. That's, I was that's the face. Oh, that's terrible. Okay. So when you're looking at taking care of it, what are some things we can do? You want to read off right here? What I wrote protein down. Up. Yeah. Increasing protein can really, really help. Adapt Adaptogens, adding in adaptogens. Hold on a second. Look, hold on so they can see, right? So get, increasing your protein helps battle stress. Getting adaptogens battles stress. Nutrient tra timing for exercise battles stress. So because uh, even though exercise is important, this is something I've chatted with a lot of women about recently. They'll add in, you know, more exercise. I'm going to the gym more. I added in 30 more minutes of cardio. Oh, yay, great. That's not a bad thing unless you're not getting the right nutrition in for that, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Yes, Katie, she really is. She really is a perfect blend of me and H. Just, <laughs> right? Uh -huh. You're very funny. So the reason why stress prevents you from getting to your weight loss goals is that it just, it's so hard. It's traumatic on the female body. So turns your metabolism into a zombie, which is not what we want, right? That's not Can what we I want. Can explain the zombie? We don't know. Everybody knows what a zombie is, kiddo. Yeah, everybody knows what a zombie is. I know. But I what know. if the babies in the watching? What if babies are watching? <laughs> you know what? That's a good question. If babies, I'm not sure. If you guys can comment, let me know if babies are, if you have babies that are watching that need to know what a zombie is. That's such a good question. Such a good question. So what I'll do is I'll put a link below and if you guys have questions um, on stress or what, you know, if you think, feel like, oh my gosh, it's got to be my stress, I'm getting this weight around my midsection, I'm not sure what to do or what's, you know, do I do all of these? Do I do one of them? Which one should I do? All that stuff. Um, I'll put a link below and you can schedule a call with me and we can chat about some best options for you moving forward. Oh, Sheila wants you to explain what a zombie is. That. There it is. <laughs> is that what you're going to be for Halloween? Now I'm going to be emotionally protecting a cow to Zilla, and it's going to be green. I thought we got you a unicorn costume. That was for the winter box one. Oh, oh plus we're going to DIY this one. Oh. That sounds so great. Do you want to show everybody what's on your shirt? What is your shirt? What's on your shirt right now? Titties. Yeah, fair, kitties fairy kitty. I think these are fairy kitties. Another not, kitty. And another kitty, yes. Okay, so when we talk about decreasing stress, right, there's different things you can do to battle the stress that you have. Fight the stress that, you, that your body has. Meaning you want to focus on a lot of these things to help your body internally battle stress. But what are some other ways to fight stress? So, Azalea, tell me, tell me your favorite way to handle stress. Watching the odd ones out, playing no. with Josefina, playing? and squishing, squishing, and swimming, and snuggling. Okay, so so playing with Josefina, right, helps mm -hmm. you decrease stress. Why do you think that helps you with stress? Because then I can literally just pet her goatee. <laughs> she has a, yeah, there's a little toy goat that goes along with Josefina, and okay, that, that's helpful. That's very, that decreases your stress. I love it. That's good. And then you said squishing your squishy. So what is this? This is a... Oh, it's one of those, like, squishy th things, right? It's, like, memory foam-ish, right? Yeah. And what happens when you squeeze it? 
It rises back up. It rises. I remember, this is like reminds me of my whoopee cushion that deflates itself. Yeah, the whoopee cushion. Lost. That we lost that. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. All yeah, we my, lost it. Remember all my other ones that Zen broke? <laughs> mm-hmm. I do remember that one. Yeah. So, do you, why do you think this helps you decrease stress? Because it's just supposed to, and like when you stress, you can literally just squeeze it to death. Squeeze it to death. Get some of that aggression out. Yeah. Oh, yay. <laughs> And then I like to do archery. Mm -hmm. Yes, all these things can really, really help decrease your stress. So there's a lot of different stress management. When we talk about stress management, this is where I chat with women and they're like, oh my goodness, I, there's so many things I can do. What do I do? What do I get started with? How do I know where to move forward? And that's where we can chat about some best options. Do we start you know, with the list here, the protein and adaptogens and all these other things? Or should you start with some stress management, other techniques, all of it, right? Um, that can be stressful and overwhelming in and of itself. So that's where I'll put that link below. You can schedule a call. We can chat about stress techniques and how to battle stress internally. So you can move from the stuck place that you're in and get a better result. So that's what I got for you guys today. You said you'd ask Josefina. I did. Oh, Josefina. I'm so sorry. You're right. I did say <laughs> that. Josefina, how do you handle stress? How do you decrease I, your stress? I feel you. It's my goodie. <laughs> oh. <laughs> What a great tip, Josefina. He's awesome. Look, oh, he's awesome. Great. Yay, Goody. Yay. Goody, yay. Josefina's excited about decreasing <laughs> the stress. So hopefully this has been helpful for you guys. So the, um, the next 12-week program I have, we are actually starting October 1st. So... If you guys are having more questions on it or wondering about it or thinking about, oh my gosh, I need to get this under control, the 12-week program would be a fantastic place for you to jump in and take care of this. So that's what I got for you guys today. If you have more questions, let me know. Otherwise, I will see you guys later. Say bye. Bye. Bye.